this is Mary Lee Selmer with the Archdiocese of New York. The other pilgrims have left. They're about to walk 10 to 12 miles to camp out for the overnight vigil. I decided to spend some time at the pool with a nice drink. Cheers. Just kidding. So really, I'm going to head out in about 30 minutes. I have to go with um, the, the media, which will be pretty cool. I'm going to have you bring you along for the ride on that. Uh, so that I can try to get closer to Pope Francis and keep you updated. And then I'll be walking out to the field and spending the night with the pilgrims. So uh, please follow along for the journey and we'll keep you updated. Right now, I am in the press center. You can kind of see it behind me. We have reporters here from all over the world. There's even more in front of me. I'll try to take a, a quick video of that as well. We're waiting for about an hour. We just went through security, and then there's gonna be buses that'll take us to the vigil. Hello, this is Mary Lee Selmer, and right now I am getting on the bus for the press. They're gonna drive us to the side of the vigil, where we're gonna have a center just for the press. And then following that, I will join the crew. Right now, I am waiting in line to climb a rather intimidating looking structure. You can see right behind me, all of the different press are climbing up, grabbing a section where they can see everything very clearly. So I'm a little afraid of heights, but I'm gonna do it for you. So I am incredibly afraid of heights, incredibly. But I'm here. Look how far you can see. This crowd, it's like impossible to capture. You just can't even see how much and how far it goes for miles. Hundreds of thousands of people. It's just incredible. Today was amazing. I spent the whole day in the press center, so we got so close to the vigil. I had to climb up this giant press box thing. Um, so I had to conquer my fears, but the view was absolutely amazing. And I got so close to Pope Francis when he drove by. Unfortunately, I couldn't um, capture it on my camera, but it was awesome. And I felt like that was one part that was just for me. So it was really cool. Right now, I'm about to sign off for the night and head out to the camp field where I will be joining all my fellow pilgrims from New York. We're gonna sleep out in the field overnight and in the morning we're gonna have mass with the Holy Father. So really excited for tomorrow. Um, final day of World Youth Day. <laughs> so sad, not ready for it to be over. But it's been an incredible week and I'm truly grateful for all of the amazing opportunities that the week has presented. I never thought that I would even see Pope Francis once in person, let alone twice in two days. It's been unbelievable. So um, yeah, just a lot to be grateful for and signing off. Have a good night. Ooh, ooh.